going on YouTube? I am back, Miss Pretty. Please excuse the hair, honey. I had a long day and it's raining out here in Central Virginia. So, you guys are gonna have to excuse me. Um, anyways, I got some good news. And um, as you all know from the last video, I let you guys know I'm gonna be doing a documentary. Um, so you guys can get to see, you know, a little bit more about me and instead of just 10 minute videos and everything like that. And I'll let you guys, you know, know that that's what I was going to be doing. Any event, um, I just want you guys to know that, um, it's going to be like a two week, uh, recording. Um, I'm dealing with some people with the arts department, um, of VCU. I also, however, am um, going to be dealing with someone that has camera experience. Um, we're going to be dealing with the uh, editing app um, with the 4G phone. Um, we're going to be doing a, a lot of different uh, things or whatever. And so you guys are going to get to know me more and you guys are going to be seeing 20 minutes instead of 10 minutes. And it's going to be for two weeks. And you guys, I know you guys are going to enjoy it. Um, and if we extend on some of the videos, it may be like 20 minutes to maybe 22 minutes. Um, nothing past 30 minutes. So, um, excuse me. So, um, it's going to be flawless. And you guys are going to love it. And um, it's going to be, you know, basically me just, you know, Letting you guys see me, you know, wake up in the morning, take my dose, um, my testosterone blocker in the morning. You guys are going to see me take my estrogen in the um, afternoon. And you guys are going to see uh, me put on my patch as well as my take my pill. Um, so basically, I just want to update you guys on that also. I am now on the patch as well as the pill. I will be starting the patch again today. Um, the patch is definitely something that um, is a better quality because it goes straight into the bloodstream and the pill, it passes through like the, I think the liver or kidneys or something like that. It passes through all these other different things before it, it releases out in the bloodstream. So um, a lot of people think, oh, because it's easier, it's the pill and all of that, that the patch doesn't really do its thing or whatever, or it just doesn't look attractive. Honey, you can put it on your arm on your um it's called the um something to something to whatever anyways you can put i put mine right here you can put it on your arm you can put it on your leg my doctor even said you can put it on your forehead honey just not on your boobies just not on the girls and yes um i've had another growth spurt as you guys can see yes my babies Look, look at that. Look at it, you guys. You guys see it up here, how it's getting all big? <laughs> yes, yes, I know I was getting a little extra with that, letting y'all get up and close and personal. Uh-uh, y'all need to back up. No, I'm just messing. So anyways, um, so yes, um, you guys are going to get to know more about me. And I am doing the patch um, and the pill. And um, it's going to be equal enough to three milligrams. I will be on four milligrams in October. I was only just doing two. Um, first, I was on 0 0.1, and then um, as far as the patch, then I switched to the mill uh, to the pill, which is two milligrams is the same thing as 0 0.1. I've seen people say that um, two milligrams is more than 0 0.1 patch. That's not true. That's inaccurate. Um, they're the same thing. So, and I know it may seem different because it's 0 0.1 and 2 milligrams. It, it, it doesn't equal out to the same thing as the patch. Trust me, I know. Um, I did my homework and, um, and some people that are in that field let me know this. So, um, well-known good doctors and practitioners agrees. So, in any event, I'm also going to be getting certified in sex and gender orientation. It's a two-day class and I'm going to be taking... 
Um, I'm already educated in sex and gender orientation. It's going to be like second nature to me, um, just like spiritual psychology was when I got certified um, and as a spiritual counselor, aka angel therapist. is the same thing as spiritual counselor here because it's not Hawaii. And the only place that accepts uh, spiritual counseling, I mean, uh, angel therapy is like in Hawaii. So um, it, does, it doesn't register here in VA as that, so it's spiritual counseling. Also, I am certified in substance abuse as an advocate for um, a good co no company out here in the city, um, HRI, stuff like that. So, yes. Um, so you guys are going to be getting a lot from me, you know, someone that, you know, is educated in this field that has, you know, a, a lot of education, you know, so, but I will say that you guys will see some good drama too, so it's not going to be just this all, you know, uh, professional, upright type of person, you know, because I am a very much so educated professional woman, but um, I like to party just like everybody else that is in their upper 20s. Um, and no, I am not 29, no. But my birthday is coming up, however, and yes, I'm 27 years old. Um, but, and women, you don't ever ask a woman their age, so you have to allow them to tell you. <laughs> but yeah, that's my age, believe it or not, I am 27, darlings. Um, so yeah, you guys are going to be seeing that from me soon, and I got... I got a lot in store for you guys. So you guys are going to see me partying. You guys are going to see me doing my HRT, talking about my HRT, talking about my gender dysphoria. When I knew I had gender dysphoria, when I started experiencing gender dysphoria, you're going to see my dating life. You're going to see um, my party life. You're going to probably be seeing me get into it with people because um, we're still in the midst of filming and stuff like that, getting stuff together. And yeah, it's going to be some arguments um, and maybe a couple of fights too. So it's going to be entertaining because what reality show or documentaries is good without some drama. So yeah, you're going to see professional stuff, fun stuff, party stuff, emotional stuff, as well as some drama. So I hope you guys like this video and I cannot wait to do the documentary. It's going to be 20 minutes long to 30 minutes at the most and it's going to be going on for two weeks and the set date of that is going to be released. It's going to be in May, not May the 1st, but I will let you guys know the set date when everything is a wrap. Love you guys and see you till then. Oh, I'm sorry and see you later. Until then, talk to you guys later. Mwah.